little peaches, my name is Alex Emily and welcome back to episode 2 of our Pokemon Black Randomizer Nuzlocke. Uh, in the first episode, we started the series. We had our starter, Ned, the Drudigan. Um, overall I think it went pretty well, episode 1. Uh, we got our starter, Ned, who is level 10 with the adamant nature, which I only just noticed. Uh, with levitate and the moves leer, scratch, home claws, and bite. We got Burb, the Dodrio, level 11 with speed boost, which is amazing, by the way. Uh, with pet growl, wing attack. Try again. Pet growl, quick attack, and rage. And we have Kevin, the Agron, with Honey Gather, level 10, with Tackle, Harden, Mudslap, and Headbutt. Between the two episodes, I did grind a little bit just to get everyone up to about the same level. Uh, one trainer I fought had a Rayquaza. We survived, which is good, but that was scary. Um, it kept whispering me, I was quite scared. And today, we crack on into Striton City. I reckon we're taking on the first gym today. I reckon we're taking on the first gym, and I'm a bit nervous about that, I must admit. But, I mean... I uh, don't know the levels for um, the gym, so I'm a bit nervous. But we do get a gift Pokemon actually. If we go to the Dream Yard, I think we get a gift Pokemon. It's usually Pansir, no, Pan, yeah, Pansir Simi, no, Pansir Pansage or Pan Poor. Um, based on what your starter Pokemon was. I think my starter technically replaced Oshawa, which means I would get Pansir, I think, but it should be randomized. If not, we'll use it as a token, which I explained in the last episode. Yeah, if you're unfamiliar with an Oslock, um, I explained it all in the last episode, but the basics is if a Pokemon faints, it is dead, you can't use it anymore, and you can only catch one Pokemon uh, the first book when you encounter uh, Pearl Root, etc, etc. I'm sure you get the gist of it by now. Um, but I think the Pansir should be randomised. If it's not, we'll take it as a token and we'll go randomly get another encounter somewhere else during the game. Ned is level 11 though, which we love to see. We love to get some levels. Weedle should be able to take this down. Should be able to take down this little one here with a bite. Should be easy. Should be pretty easy. Smashed it. Not hard. Not hard, is it? But yeah, I think we start off by going over here. And is it you? No, you just fight me. You just fight me. Sad. Okay. What we got? Quillfish. Aw. My boyfriend really likes this one. But yeah, how are you today? I hope you're having a wonderful day. Uh, it should be days my uploading. It should be Saturday the day this goes up, so I hope you're all having a great weekend. I hope you're all having a wonderful weekend. Um, I'm probably exhausted by now because I probably would have been at work all day. So I'm probably exhausted. I'm probably like sleeping while this video is uploading or something, knowing me. Um, but yeah. I had a moment I thought that was shiny for some reason. I think that's just my brain just being dumb. Just being dumb. But yeah, if you guys are new and you're enjoying the series so far, don't forget to smash that like button and leave a comment, you know, about anything, really. It doesn't matter what. It could be anything. I'll do, like, questions of the day at some point, if I can ever think of any, that is. Um, and yeah, if you haven't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button. It takes just a second of your time and you get to see these videos when they come out. And it shows, you know, loads of support towards me, considering I'm a brand new channel uh, and I've only just kind of started. And, you know, all the love and support I can get is very much appreciated as we grow. Because, you know, it takes a while to grow as a channel. It takes a while, but I have faith. I have faith that we can. Do you give me? Yes! Your Drodigan does not do well against Grass-type Pokemon. Are you sure about that? Dratini! Dratini! I'll take a Dratini. I mean, it's another Dragon-type. Uh, does anyone have the Dratini line claimed, actually? Let me have a quick look. I don't think so. It is claimed. 
The Dratini line is claimed by my dear friend Eric. Uh, as said in the last episode, if you do want to claim a, a mascot, an evolution line, uh, then you can join my Discord server. It's for those 15 and up, and it means you can claim ones that you can then be a name in the series, which is pretty cool. So let's have a look at Eric. Yeah, it comes in at level 10, which is nice. Bold nature, what does that do? Does that. Yo, shell armor. Shell armor, though. That's kind of sick. We love to see that. We love that with Rap, Lee, and Thunder Wave. That's pretty cool. I'll keep it around. I'll definitely keep it around, but I do currently have a somewhat better dragon type at the moment. Um, I can't get over there, can I? Nope, sad. I want to go get an encounter. Sad. But I mean, hey, I'll take Grigatini. That's pretty cool. I will definitely take that. I love that. Right. So, what do I need to do to get into the gym? Trainer school. That's it. Trainer school. And then we battle Sharon in the trainer's school. I think we're pretty much ready to battle Sharon again. I don't see why not. I don't see why not. Everyone, don't forget your Wawa, by the way. I'll remind you every episode, don't forget your Wawa. Or some sort of variant of Wawa. You know, any, any sort of Wawa-like thing will do. Let's go into the trainer's school. Hello there. Hello, Sharon. Hello. Let's have a fight. Let's have a fight with Sharon. Let's kick his butt. Let's do it. Because it's just not hard, honestly. It just isn't. Alright, what's he got? What you got? There you go. Oh, no! Okay. Ugh. Uh, I don't have any... Oh, I do have a dark type move. What am I talking about? I have bite. This should be fine. Oh, it's double team. Okay. This could be a bit of a nuisance, but... Maybe we should be fine? We'll be fine. What berry have you got? What berry have you got? You got a citrus berry or a berry? Same thing. Same thing. But that's fine. Okay. Confusion. How much is that doing? Not a lot. I didn't think it would do a lot. Dragoon is quite bulky. Quite bulky. Quite annoying to take down. Because like that is a stab psychic type move from a Cresselia. I know it's four levels below, but that should still do some damage, really. And it doesn't, which is great. That's a lot of XP though. We take those. Level 13, just not hard. How many times do I have to say it? It's just not hard. Scary face. We'll get rid of Lear for scary face. We'll get rid of Lear. Simi is coming out. Okay, do we? Nah, we'll stay in. Kevin can shine at another time. We'll stay in for now. It's just that Kevin doesn't have the greatest moves in the world. I mean, none of my ones have the greatest moves right now. Um, but you know, it's a process. It's the process. It's the grind. Okay. I'm actually quite shocked that the Griselia and the Simisir are the same level. I thought the Simisir would be like a level or two higher just because it's a starter. And apparently not. Okay. Fair enough. But that was a pretty easy rival battle. I'm happy with that. Orenberry, thank you muchly. Thank you muchly. Much appreciated. Right. Now, I think we can go fight the gym. We should be pretty poggies. We'll be pretty poggies. Yes, we can. Look, Silent! Silent is, uh, he is probably like the highlight of Gen 5 anime. He tried to be Brock, which I didn't like, but still pretty decent. Still pretty decent. I mean, definitely better than Iris. Better than Ash. <laughs> kind of sick of Ash at this point, but hey ho. Right. Hello, Simon. Let's have a fight. So will I fight you? Yes, I will. I will fight you. Hmm. I'm going to I'm going to have a fight. Fresh water. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, Ashley. Right. Now, everyone in the class, can you please tell me what is strong against a fire-type Pokemon? <gasps> I know! A water-type Pokemon! Yay! And then we have a fight. Fight me! Fight me! I'm gonna kick your butt. I'm gonna kick your butt. It'll be easy. You got one more. You got a Venipede. A Venipede. Easy. 
Easy dub. Level 11 though. I think the Judas Ace is like level 14. Oh, it's got a slow start. Oh, poor little Venipede. Poor little Venipede, man. That's upsetting. That's upsetting. Imagine being a Venipede and having a slow start. To be fair, Venipede's one of the cooler, like, um, early game bug types. So, Scolopede? I love Scolopede. It's one of those bug types that I think I'd actually use. I'm not a massive fan of bug types, um, but I think Scolopede I could make an exception for. I think. Definitely one of the better ones. Gen 5 came out with some really great mons, can't lie. Some of them a bit disappointing, but some top tier, like Zoroark. Can we talk about Zoroark for a minute? Zoroark is ugh, amazing. I love it. I use it every chance I get in any game. If a Zoroark is available, then hi, I want a Zoroark. Another Quillfish? Question mark? Hmm. There seems to be a bit of a Quillfish bias. A little bit of a Quillfish bias right here. Yeah, as I was saying, I think Zoroark is such a cool one. There are some other Gen 5 ones that I really like as well, but none of them are coming to mind for some reason. Well, that didn't do a lot, did it? Keep biting it! I'm gonna speed up a little bit here, because I feel like this battle might take a little while. And I don't want you guys to just sit and watch the same thing over and over again for like 10 minutes. So we'll speed up through this, because it's the same thing. Unless it crits me and kills me, which it won't, because I'm a gamer. Even if it crit from here, it wouldn't kill me. Oh, don't! Don't do this. Just don't. Don't. No. No, don't do this to me. That was a crit. That was a crit. We ate that. Just don't crit me again. Fine. We're fine. That was annoying though. That poor fish was a little bit annoying, can't lie. Level 14 though, so we are now on par with the gym leader's ace, which is good. Uh, Swablu. Mm. We're gonna keep battling. We're gonna keep battling because it's what level 10? Okay. Um, why am I hitting Pokeballs? I don't wanna well I mean I would like to catch something, that would be pretty cool. I've got enough dragons at the moment though. But we are gonna heal up just a little bit. Just in case it does some crazy dragon move and crits me and I die or something. But now nah, we're fine. We keep biting things. This is the strat, we bite everything. Oh we got the flinch, we got the flinch. We got the flinch, which is always nice. Always nice. Easy. And then we crit it. Just, just because. Right. Is that all the gym leaders? All the gym trainers now? Gym leaders over there? Yes. So we're gonna open the curtain. But then what we're gonna do is run back to the Pokemon Center to go heal. Uh, Cause I could use potions, but like that's a waste of potions when the Pokemon Center is basically next door. Like literally next door. So we're gonna go heal real quick. And then we're gonna take on Silen. And we're gonna hope for the best. I'm not too worried. Um, unless he has something insane, like, I don't even know what at this point, honestly. But, I reckon we should be fine. I reckon we should be a-okay. I think we'll be fine against this gym, and then we can crack on and go straight to the dream yard after, I think. Oh, I'd have to teach something cut. I don't really want to do that, but hey hey. I think I'd probably teach um, Burb Cut. Just because I feel like Burb is the one I'm probably going to end up using the least. Um, I feel like that would be okay with Cut. Should be fine. Don't see why not. Right! The gym leader music for Gen 5 is top tier. The music in Gen 5 in general is top tier. Oh no! Hello! Oh no! Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear. Mm, you want speed? Okay, in prison. Okay, I don't think we have any moves. Okay, if you just keep hitting in prison, so I can just continuously like do this. Fire fang! Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I know it's not very effective, but I was scared because it is a rush around. Dragon Rage Claws. I lived. I didn't notice I had enough HP to live it. Is there anything else over 40 HP yet? No. Which means this is... I'm not going to bother healing, so it's probably going to go for Dragon Rage again. He healed. I could have healed. But 
the thing about Dragon Rage is that before the second gym, Dragon Rage does not count as a, um, but that did. I assumed it was Dragon Rage. I assumed it was Dragon Rage. This isn't good. We've just had our first loss already and it's only episode 2, but I assumed it was Dragon Rage again! This isn't good. It's Dragon Rage, I guess Dragon Rage. Dragon Rage Claws, so anything that is killed by Dragon Rage does not count as a death. So that means the only death so far is Dragon, which sucks. I can't believe that it's... Are you joking? Like, are you actually joking? Can I click attack it? Will that ki it won't kill it. It won't kill it, Dragon Rage does it. That sucks. That sucks. That absolutely sucks. That's just unfortunate. Oh, that's unfortunate. But now that I know it has Dragon Rage, fire fan. Really, 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 really. I feel like if Rap kills this, I mean, I still lose because there's no way that the strategy will be able to take out whatever's next. Um. I knocked out a restaurant with a wrapping routine. <laughs> oh, the XP! <laughs> I don't think Dratini's gonna be able to. Uh, twist her first. Dratini's gonna be able to take out whatever's next. Um, a croconaw. Okay, and that's a what, 14? Yeah. Okay, um, I mean, to be fair, I can't. What am I doing? I just that. I know I can't. I mean, Kevin and Burb are not dead. They're not dead. Um, so even if I lose this battle, because of Dragon Rage, they are not dead. So if I actually do manage to win, I, I don't think I will, but if I do, no, I'm not gonna. I'm just not gonna. Let's twist her it to at least get a bit of stab. To at least get a little bit of stab. That sucks, I know we lost Dragon that early on. I mean, we have Dratini, which is another dragon type, but like, Dratini isn't great until um, it evolves. Right, let's be honest. I'm speeding up through this because we've we've lost this battle. Which sucks what Oh it's rage. I always forget that rage does like the um, powering up like boosting stat effect. And I'm like, what what is that are you raising? Hello? I mean I'm not gonna bother like hit healing, sitting and healing through this because chances are Silent will heal again. And actually to be fair. Should I just go for it? I shouldn't go for it. We're just gonna go for it. We're gonna see if we can actually win the battle, because I would actually like to win it. Uh, just so I don't have to deal with that rush land again, but Rage is building. Rage is building. Rage is building, which is sad. Rage has built. That'll knock me out. It didn't knock me out. Hmm. But the Rage is building. Um, I might fresh water up, so that's 50, doesn't it? Yes, that'll completely heal me. I am going to speed up through this. I know I said in the first episode, but I'm not really doing much of a speed up thing. But in situations like this, uh, I think speeding up is okay because it is the same thing back and forth. Um, I'm going to try and win. Please don't heal. You've already healed once, so I feel like you won't heal again. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, 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 we have a chance, we have a chance, but that only does 20. Oh god, I'm gonna have to heal twice in a row. Mm, okay. Oh, to be fair, I could live that. Twister, don't kill. Mm. We actually won! <laughs> we actually won! Oh, we actually won! I can't believe we actually won that. I can't believe my little Dratini just won that. <laughs> Yo, we have an MVP. We have an MVP. Oh my god, that Reshiram. I'm so upset that we lost um, Ned. We lost our starter in episode 2. <laughs> which sucks. Uh, just a reminder though that Kevin and Burb, the Agron and Odrio, are not dead because they died to Dragon Rage before the second gym. Therefore, they're not dead. Tail Glow. Nice, we take that. We take that. Thank you for Tail Glow. They are not dead. 
So, we cry about it, because we just lost our starter to me being an idiot and realising it wasn't gonna Dragon Rage, because it was in range to kill me with something else. Um, but yeah. Can I go heal, please? I don't want to follow you. My All my mons are dead. <laughs> I want to go to the Pokemon Center and cry, okay? That's all I want to do. Pretty please. Okay, okay. We have to- I'm gonna- I know I said, like, I'm not gonna use my speed up, but I'm gonna speed up through C gear. We get cut, which I'll now probably give to- I could give it to Ned just to have the, um... Can I just go? Cool. I can just go straight to the dream yard. I'm gonna see if Ned can learn this, because now I can just- Where it is dead, I can still use it as, like, an HM slave, but, like, yeah. Cool. Ned can link up. And you can get rid of whatever. I'm so sad I lost Ned. I am so sad I lost Ned. I'm heartbroken. He was gonna be like my MVP. He was gonna like run me through the game. And he died. Because I'm an idiot. Which is sad. So let's go heal. Let's at least put him away in the PC forever fully healed. You know, gotta be nice like that. Gotta be nice. Okay. So let's put him away. Let's put him away. Let's put him in what I will now call the... This is the death box. We cry because he's in the death box. Why did I... Why did I just put him in the death box? I need him to get to the dream yard. So I'm an idiot. Don't worry about it. I'm just an idiot. It's fine. It's fine. I'm just an idiot. I'm just an idiot. It's fine. Don't worry about it. But yeah, let's head out to the dream yard. Let's... Uh, you're not at the front of my party, are you? Because I can't use you. Yes. Okay, we're good. We're good. He's at the back. We're fine. Right. Let's get a dream yard encounter, actually. I get that, which is cool. Right. Sad. I miss Ned. I miss Ned. My eyes, I'm really sorry, my eyes are kind of like really dry and straining right now, so if I'm blinking a lot or like squinting a lot, um, it's just because my eyes kind of hurt right now. Oh no. Uh, I don't really know why. I have been staring at the screen for a little while, I must admit, so it's probably that. But after this episode, I am coming off the PC for a little bit, but I am going to stream. I'm streaming in under an hour, but at the time I'm recording this actually. So, hmm. I didn't realise it was actually that late already. Right, so they're about to kick a moon on, I think. I think they kick it. Like, I think they actually kick it. He actually kicks it! Which is- that's abuse. That is actual abuse. I'm gonna sneeze. No, I'm not. We're good. That is actual abuse. Which is kind of horrible. Oh! Right. What is it with these legendaries? <laughs> Hello. Um, to be fair, if you have a ground type move, you can't hit me. Oh god, I can do a lot. I love that I said I wasn't going to hit the speed up button, and here I am getting stuck in these kind of battles where I need to hit the speed up button, otherwise it is like 20 minutes of just this. Oh, are you just going to scary face me? Aren't you lowering my speed? But then, oh, but wait. Mm, so I am losing speed because it's partially falling, but oh, we got crit. Ha, <laughs> my shot doesn't affect me, silly. But I'm using quick attack anyway, so speed doesn't matter because I'm using fire speed. Luckily, Groudon cannot hit me. Which is always nice. We appreciate that. We appreciate that Groudon can't actually hit me. <laughs> that is some fat XP right there, though. Gimme. Num 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 num. Num num num. Fat XP. We eat that. Yummy. Level 13. Yummy. Easy peasy. Do I have to fight the second one as well? Yes, I do. Don't have a Kyogre. <laughs> Don't have another legendary. That would kind of suck. Oh, timber. I can do with Timber. That's fine. You're a fighting type, so I can just peck you to death. This is, this is fine. <laughs> This is fine, she says. I'll break her. I saw that. We can peck it to death. Easy. One shot. That wasn't even a crit. We're just that good. 
Easy. Right. I want to get this encounter in here, and then I'll probably wrap up the episode. Stop kicking it! Stop kicking it! Oh. Getsis. Oh, look. Another Getsis. Oh, look. Another Getsis. Was it? It was Mushana. I really like Muna and Mushana. Like that cry that Mushana has is really cool. It's really cool. Um, but yeah, yes, that is Mushana. That's such a cool cry. They both have really cool cries. Oh, Dream Mist. Um, but I do want to get my encounter. So can you guys shut up? Because I'd like to get my encounter. Please, 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 please. Yes, it's Dream Mist. I'll come over at some point. But I want my encounter. Encounter, 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 encounter. Okay, what we got? A Carablast! I'm pretty sure I have Impossible Evos turned um, off. So I should be able to actually evolve this. Because obviously... Wait, you're a bar type. Is this going to kill? Don't kill. I killed it. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind, I guess. Fury attack. Uh, we'll take it over Growl. Why not? Why not? I'm dumb. And use a flying type move on a bug type because I'm dumb. So we lost that encounter, which sucks. And anything else we could have got? Or is it just Carablasts? Carablast City. Okay, that's fine. Kind of sad about that. Because I think I'm possibly if I was turned off, so like it would have evolved on level up instead of having to like trade with a Shelmet. Um, so that's sad, but hey ho. Let's grab a Dusk Ball. That'll be useful for nighttime episodes. Or anything in a cave. Carnivine, could have got a Carnivine. That would have been pretty cool. I don't think I would have used it much, because I mean. Carnivine. Mm. Ooh, it shuddered just because I have a flying type move, boy. Or girl, I think it was a girl, oops. I don't gender stereotype. I would never. Carnivine is back for revenge. Carnivine is back for revenge, but I'm not interested. I'm not interested. I just want to see if there's any more items. Or what I might do is just kind of run through the fennel bit. Just to get it out of the way. We'll do that. Excuse me. We'll do the fennel bit. I don't think I can get any of the other items that are kind of chilling out at the moment. Or if I can, I'll come back and grab them. It'll be fine. But yeah, so we lost the Carablast. I didn't... <laughs> I didn't think, I just went, oh, I'll just peck it, it should live, and then realised it's a bug type, it's super effective, and it died. So let's quickly heal up, and then we'll go do the fennel stuff. She'll give me the C gear, I'll say no, I don't want to turn it on, because it'll break my whole computer. I mean, my totally legit DS that I'm totally legit playing on right now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, so let's go see fennel. Let's go be bored by fennel. Let's just like speed up through this whole bit because let's be honest, no one cares. Hello. 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 This doesn't work anymore. Thank you for my sea gear. No. Yes. No, oh, I just said yes to learning more. Uh, free me. Please free me. Is that my journal? Pal pad. Pal pad. Okay, can I go now? Can I go? Yay! Let's leave! Let's leave! Okay. Well, that started off pretty great. But I think I'm gonna wrap up there. What did we do today? We got our first gym badge, we failed an encounter at the dream yard, and we did lose our starter to a restaurant. But these things happen. Uh, but anyway, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you had a great time with me today. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave a comment down below letting me know uh, how disappointed you are in me over the fact I just lost our um, starter. My bad. My bad. Can't be helped. But I hopefully will see you all next time. Have a wonderful rest of your day and goodbye.